Hello everyone and welcome back to Final Fantasy 1. We are gonna try. We're gonna save when we get up there. Before we enter the castle. Despite my increased defenses for all my characters, that ogre still hits like a freaking truck. I'm gonna turn this down just a scooch more because it was a little bit overpowering from Monday's stream, I noticed. Now, I'm not gonna waste any spell slots right now because we... I bought a couple cottages with our infinite supply of cash, but I didn't want to go crazy. And I also feel like we don't really need to be going all out on... There it is. We don't really need to be going all out on our spells right now. Most of the things we run into, we're probably going to run away from regardless. Let's see where we're at. We got... This is my big problem. It's the gap. Because Sabin has died with both of our big boss fights that we've had. I don't count the pirates as a boss fight. The gap is just widening between him and the other three. And we don't want that. We don't... It'll be good when we're in locations that have characters that can do like level 3 and level 4 spells if they do have those in this game. I don't know if they do. I'm not fighting a bunch of tarantulas. I'm just gonna run. But if they do, the fact that we have that, just enough of that gap should put us in a good spot. Why, what is happening with the enemies striking first? Each of these uh, battles have been enemy goes first. If we can just take down the worm really quickly, it should be okay. Problem is, the worm has a lot of health for no, no real good reason. The ogre also has a lot of health, but the ogre I'm not as concerned with because the ogre doesn't hit as hard as the worm, which is crazy to say. I would have really enjoyed to see Vivi hit that one health and be the killing factor for the ogre. I want that. I want that kind of poke. Ugh. Now we need to go further this way first, yeah. And I think the big thing is in order for us to beat Astos, Vivi cannot die. So what? I'm not. I'm not gonna sit here for ten minutes trying to fight a bunch of wolves. <laughs> well, maybe I will. Nope. Okay, Vivi. Vivi got us out of there. Thank goodness for them. Okay. We're here. We're going to tent up and save. I, st I feel like we still have too many tents. A <laughs> little bit of a cheaty number of tents. I don't know. We have infinite money. <laughs> I shouldn't be talking about this in this regard. Well, we have 11. Oh, no, that's steps. Never mind. For those who missed it or were not paying attention on Monday, I got tired of having to grind out money. I'm still willing to grind out experience, but I put in a, a little cheatsy code to grant myself infinite money. I just maxed out the gill. So, I mean, with there being 950, it went to 999999 and I have since gone down to 950. There, things could get that expensive. I haven't looked ahead. I don't want to. I don't like to look ahead unless 
from stuck on a bit and it's not looking ahead it's trying to figure out the present so we might run into stuff that is expensive enough that it'll deplete that cash and if that's the case and I need to turn the thing back on we'll do that but right now we just have to hope that Astos does not cast Reaper on one of us now that's gonna do one uh, we're gonna go for our higher echelon spells and I'm gonna try bolt instead of fire I think I tried ice the first time and we're gonna see if we can silence Astos because that was a recommended thing okay if if Saturn dies again I think ugh. I think I hate everything right now. <laughs> that did work. I just, I don't, I don't want Sabin to die. If any of the others besides Vivi or Sabin die, I'll be okay. Actually, you know what? <laughs> let me, let me rephrase it. If Corvo dies, that's okay. But the other three I kind of feel are necessary. And I need, I need her. Uh, Ophelia for heals, I need Vivi for damage, and I need Sabin's experience to not keep getting pushed into the toilet. I don't want to keep resetting though if Sabin keeps dying, so I'm not gonna do it again. I'm just being hopeful that the silence can maybe go off first. Or that Reaper can hit somebody that's not so feeble. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Yes, Astos, we know. I was actually pretty aware that that was what was going to happen. Uh, as we came up and talked to you on Monday. Doo -doo 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 -doo. So we're gonna do this the same way, and we're gonna try the, the silence worked. So, oh, oh my gosh, it missed. Ah, uh, come on. You had the opportunity to go first and then you missed. That is just really disappointing because Ophelia, you are now responsible for Sabin's death. That's on you. I'm gonna try this silence again. So that time it worked. I just need to... get a bunch more hits off here. I'm not sure if Astos had physical attacks or if they're just gonna sit there now. Okay, he does. They're not terrible. I am gonna use a cure here. Your hero. Oh, and that's it. <sighs> Sabin's gonna be behind by an entire level. This hurts. Now what? Obtained Crystal Eye. Oh, I can't turn around and sit on the throne. I am the king now. I can see inside that room now. Hmm. 
I can't go in there though. I know it's locked. The way is shut. Was there any other rooms in here? If there are, I'm assuming they're all gonna be locked. I need the mystic key. I am just so sad for Sabin. <laughs> Sabin has just become the sponge getting hit and killed at every boss fight. Even if Sabin was alive, there's no way I'm taking on those. <laughs> mm -mm. Ah! Let's get back to town so that I can revive. No. Wasn't gonna deal with two. You want me to take. Uh oh. That was scary. I guess I better stop for a second and give some potions to Vivi. That feels better. That feels a lot better. Now we just got to stop running into these packs of worms. So we can get back and raise Sabin. Ah, it's gonna be worms again. Oh, it's scorpions. Even worse. Oh, <laughs> fucking scorpions! They hit hard and they poison. Antidote. Potion. Do, 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 do. Bring Sabin back. Poor Sab Pat Sabin by the end of this game is going to be like level 20 and the rest of them are going to be level 50. Sabin is going to be the, the sacrificial meat puppet at each boss. Here, we brought you some succulents while we smack your butt to death. What's going on back there? Nothing. Focus on Sabin. Okay. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> what is this fiction I'm crafting? Yeah, let's save it. Now that we're done with Astos. It's sort of like a new chapter, so we'll... We didn't need to be level 8 at all. That... That guy lied to us. It's definitely not that I just got lucky and had a... Well, I don't know. Well, maybe lucky. No, lucky would have been if silence had worked and Sabin had been spared. I don't feel lucky about what we did. <laughs> I feel defeated. Okay, hello. Now I gotta figure out how this freaking thing works. Crystal eye? Oh, I can just move these around. Why? Can somebody tell me how this works? Well, I don't believe I need the dwarves for this. Could be wrong. All right, I guess I gotta figure out <laughs> how do I use items. <clears throat> to 
defeat Dark Elfastos to obtain the crystal, travel to Matoya's cave. Oh, oh, I gotta go back to Matoya. That's a good point. Matoya was, uh, somebody in this castle told me about this, didn't they? I think so. I think somebody mentioned Matoya in here. Or maybe it was in Elfheim, like in the town. Either way, uh, let's fix our formation here. Not that it matters, but I do like looking at Shavin. Uh, do I? Ooh, I've moved. I've got a level four slot at. Uh, all right. Oh, this can confuse all of them. Ooh. I still don't understand what haste is gonna do. I don't understand what haste and slow do in this game. You pick all your moves at once. Is it just turn order? Just gonna. I just noticed that everybody has over a hundred health now, which is good. Oh, come now. Why can nobody hit their targets? This is just always the, oh shit. The war wolf has more health than I realized. We are vastly falling into disrepair here. This should be enough, right? As long as Sabin hits his target, Sabin, Thank you. There we go. The warg is down. Do, 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 do. Vivi's still not strong enough to take out a wolf on his own, on their own, without magic. Okay, we're in the boat. We'll use some potions. So we're gonna make our, we're, which, what would be the faster route here? Probably up to the first town. And then up, yeah, that seems, that seems like that'll be less distance. Oh look, a bunch of goblins. This is not a fight worth fighting because I'm just going to get like two experience. Thank you. So I guess I guess we should be doing it because uh, even even two experiences four four even four will start to get Sabin closer to level eight which is where everybody else already is uh, I wish we could have parked up here but I don't believe I can actually get up and around to here yet uh, war wolves we've got some enemies that can give us a little bit more substance to our fights although these war wolves might be a little cheaper by the dozen maybe not Ophelia is certainly not pulling her weight anymore 
and Corvo's just missing. But these wolves are really weak. Corvo! Hit your targets! Please! Figured it would be better to take out the wolves first because the warg wolf has a lot of health. But all the wolves together will take a lot of damage to take down and then I proceed to miss and miss and miss. Stop missing. There we go. 50. 50 experiments. At this rate, <laughs> we're gonna be here for hours. Oh gosh, the, the jump is pretty high too. Give me an Octopath Traveler style where you get the same amount of experience but it's just diminishing returns on higher levels. I don't know why I'm putting my two strongest characters to fight one wolf. But I suppose it doesn't matter. We did it! Oh, I feel wiped out. It's probably the waiting around for a call this morning that never came. Still not sure what happened there. You know, this actually might be a good opportunity for Fire 2. Especially if we get closer to the high end of my damage output. And here... I'll just use a, a lowly cure. Come on, do the big guns. Oh, hell yeah. The worms are out. Oh, and the ogre too. Damn. We rocked that party. Now that's obviously still not a viable path until we're, we have more spell slots, but I mean, we do have three uses of fire too right now. So we're gonna, we're gonna tra chase this dragon for a little bit. If you killed Vivi right now, I would be very disappointed that they didn't get their spell off. The ogre survived this time. There they go. Bye! See, if we could keep getting that, if we could keep up that kind of energy, it would be a lot easier to do these little grinds, but... Hello? Is that my crystal eye? Give it to... Wait, wasn't this a... Wasn't this a female? Matroya? Matoy? Matoya? Matoya? That's not the right word. Matroska? That's a doll. Is that my crystal eye? Give it to me. Here. I'll give you the most wondrous potion from my collection. The Jolt Tonic. So the Jolt Tonic is what we actually need to give the Elf Prince. Ah, now I can see everything. Now get out of here, nothing else for you. Wow, thrown out with the dirty bath water here. <laughs> 